All right, today I want to sh focus on the concept of uh, cause and effect, shifting, shifting away from being at the whim of effects that occur within your reality and then transitioning towards causes and being the cause and focusing on causes and not getting caught up in effects or outcomes or things that occur. And when we're in a mindset or in, a real, in our reality of all these events occurring and happening around us, we're very much at the whim of, of what's going on and we're reacting to things that happen and all these things that are happening are outside of our control. And when we do that, we give away our power because all we're doing is just reacting and, and acting based on what is already happening and what has already happened. And when we fall into states of, of uh, anger or when there's upset about what is occurring, it's fundamentally a denial of reality. When, we, when we're getting triggered all the time by things that are occurring, we're not accepting reality as it is. And we're saying, no, I don't, I don't want that. I don't, I don't accept that. And there's this like, there's this like inner barrier that's stopping you from moving forward and holding on to this, this inner tension within your body. And so I think the key is being aware of where you're being triggered by events happening around you and bring that awareness of ob observation of what's happening, observing it as it happens and not getting caught up in having to do something about it and then shifting your attention to causes and what's, a, what's causing these outcomes to happen and focusing your attention on what's within your control and what's within your control is the causes, things you do, the, the choices you make within your life result in effects, effects out in the world. So transitioning away from, from, from a, a reactive state into more of a creative state, a creative, like it's like the pre, the pre state before the effect, like the cause happens you create the cause and it results in an effect. So it's that focus away from being at the end of the process and then transitioning backwards and being at the creative level, creating your own reality and focusing on what's within your control, what you can control within your reality, being, you know, acting on, on what you want to do and what kind of life you want to create and focus there then being at the effect of what happens and reacting based on what happens you're always in this in this um sort of uh fighting fires so to speak mentality at the end and you're not really actually able to create the change you want because you're not involved in the creation process you're just at the end of the stage reacting to whatever occurs around you so it's a subtle shift um, moving away from that effect reactivity based awareness into a more of a what's what's within my control what can I change within my reality what's within my power how can I how can I move from a position of my own power and what I want in my life Yeah, so I think that's a, a big one to, to give some thought to about how you can be the creator of your own reality instead of giving away your power and being at the whim of life itself and being in a, being in a sort of blame, um, a very, a very like, poor me sort of mentality to taking back your 
power and seeing everything is within my control and what what kind of world do I want to live in, what kind of uh, person do I want to be and moving from that centered place to then act upon upon those um, thoughts and and decisions that you've made about about your own choices. See so yeah, let's leave it at that.